I want my wife. Yes. If they have killed her, let them give me the body. Yes. The case in which Francis Onebe was arrested to help in the investigation of the death of his wife, Immaculate Onebe, has taken a new twist. Uganda police has established that a bag tied on the decomposing body of Immaculate contained suspected remains of a human being. With other seeming body bones of hands, the lips and the legs. And it became now uh, a puzzle. So inevitably, we, have, we had to do post-mortem on two dead bodies. Blood samples from the daughter of the deceased have been collected to ascertain whether they match with the two dead bodies. It may only match to only one dead body. The puzzle we have is to whom does the second body belong to. Police appeals to the public to report any missing person who might have been working at Francis Onebe's home. So that we interview, uh, probably if the right person we can take some samples for DNA profiling. Immaculate Onebe disappeared on the 6th January 2021 and until police made a search at the residence, no smell was sensed by the neighborhood. There are so many avenues of how you can mitigate smell. Some of them are chemicals and we have taken samples of those bad things for examination. As of now, no suspect has been charged as investigations continue. The good news is that we have built a formidable and uh, a formidable laboratory at Naguru uh, and we are very, very optimistic that the results will be out. Francis Onebe was running a private security company called Pentagon Security, a poster pinned at the wall of his residence. Ivan Kahua, UBC News, in Munyonyo.